the illustration how you can use Spring Cloud Interflow uh, to leverage the latest and recent TensorFlow object detection API to detect multiple objects in a single stream or uh, stream of uh, images into single image, sorry, or a stream of images and video streams. For this, we're going to use a, a new uh, Spring Cloud Stream object detection processor that leverages the TensorFlow object detection API and uses the one of the pre-trained object detection model. There are a couple of those with different accuracy and different speed for processing and each of those models uh, supports a different uh, subset of uh, categories it can detect within the images. So this uh, object detection Processor, Spring Cloud Interflow Object Detection Processor can be configured with uh, one of those models and the uh, uh, labels categories. And when run, it would produce uh, metadata about it uh, <coughs> with uh, information about the category being detected, object or build pack, and the bounding box of the category or the detected object within the image itself. I registered Spring Cloud Interflow. I have a Spring Cloud Interflow server running on my local machine with the default of, um, <coughs> uh, components plus the object detections. One that uh, we just explored, object detector, and the uh, image viewer. This is a handy sync uh, component that allows me to visualize uh, images. It's a sync uh, processor applications. Let's jump and build our pipeline. We're going to monitor an input folder for uh, images being dropped there. So we're going to use the file source component with directory set to temp input images. The, any file or any image that is dropped there would be streamed as a byte array to the object detector processor. We're going to use the uh, OK header. So the, the detected object metadata, this JSON file that I showed earlier, is going to be put in the, as a header message. And the output is going to be sent to the image, image viewer. For visualization of the stuff. By default, the let me see. So you see how the stream looks like. By default, um, the <coughs> processor is uh, configured to draw or actually augment the input image with a bounding um, uh, box with, uh, contained around the detect object, with um, uh, containing the the name and the confidence of the detect object as well. So uh, any image that we drop here would expect to appear within the image viewer annotated with detected objects as well. Let's deploy this. Let's call it object detection stream. Create and deploy the stream. This might take uh, a minute to download the involved uh, components applications and deploy them. Let's take now canonical image here. As you can see it's rather large image. So this is the detected image that corresponds to our input Can see persons and kites have been detected, which is uh, quite uh, similar to the results uh, we can see on the original TensorFlow page. Let's pick another image is pivot to a specific one and see how the processor would recognize it, what objects would recognize in this image. Yeah, 
interesting we have the people chair vase even the dining table recognized here plant nice and impressive this concludes the demo